W. Somerset Maugham. Somerset Maugham, 1874 to 1965, was a British playwright, novelist, and short story writer, renowned for his lucid, unadorned style and keen insight into human nature. He is considered one of the most popular writers of his era, having written works that reflect his experiences in different parts of the world, including Asia and the South Pacific. Maugham's stories often feature ordinary people faced with life's ironies, complexities, and moral dilemmas. Some of his best-known works include Of Human Bondage, The Razor's Edge, and numerous short stories like The Verger. His writing, while accessible, is known for its subtle wit, psychological depth, and sharp observations of social behaviors. Detailed Summary of The Verger by Somerset Maugham The Verger is a short story about Albert Edward Foreman, a man who has worked as a verger, caretaker of the church, at St. Peter's Church, Neville Square, for 16 years. He is proud of his job and is highly regarded by the congregation for his dedication and service. The story begins with Foreman, a humble, orderly man, going about his duties at the church with great satisfaction. One day, a new vicar arrives at the church, who is more progressive and modern than his predecessors. After noticing that Foreman cannot read or write, the vicar summons him to his office. The vicar and two churchwardens express their surprise at Foreman's illiteracy and inform him that it is not proper for a verger of such a reputable church to be uneducated. Despite Foreman's impeccable record and long service, the vicar gives him an ultimatum. Either learn to read and write within three months or resign from his position. Albert Foreman, a man of principles and tradition, refuses to accept this condition. He explains that he has never needed to read or write during his 16 years of service and sees no reason to start now. With dignity, Foreman hands in his resignation and leaves the church, despite the great affection he has for his job. Out of work and wandering the streets of London, Foreman feels disheartened, but he soon regains his composure. While walking around, he notices a neighborhood without a tobacconist shop. Realizing a business opportunity, he decides to open a small tobacco and cigarette shop using the savings he has accumulated over the years. His venture quickly becomes a success and Foreman expands his business by opening more shops throughout London. As the years go by, Foreman grows wealthy from his thriving chain of tobacco shops. One day, during a meeting with his banker, the manager is astonished by Foreman's financial success and asks him to sign some important documents. When Foreman admits that he cannot read or write, the banker is utterly surprised and remarks, imagine what you could have been if you had been literate. Foreman wittily replies, I'd still be the verger of St. Peter's Church, Neville Square. The story ends on a humorous note, showing that Foreman's illiteracy, which was seen as a disadvantage, actually led to his great success. Mom's The Verger is a story about resilience, self-reliance, and the idea that success can come from unexpected places, even from perceived limitations. Key themes, one, self-reliance. 